Jack it up.
feel the waves cut through me, hypnotized by the sounds I'm breathing in. Hold tight, hold tight, can't make calls collide. Hold tight, hold tight, hold tight. Dripping lights paint the sky.
watch. It's the Czech Republic versus France. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Griezmann. A good and fair challenge. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris is the goalkeeper. Rafael Varane plays alongside Presnel Kimpembe at the back. And up front, Kylian Mbappe plays alongside Karim Benzema. Couldn't put it away. Offside, however. Well, he'll certainly be pleased to see the flag go up there because that was a poor miss. Well, we know how troublesome he can be on the pitch, but what should we expect from him today, Stuart? Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. And that's an important intervention. An incisive pass. And still an opportunity. of room in the wide area well as you can hear the fans think that should have been a penalty but I'm not convinced well the tackle vivacious from Varane Griezmann Chouameni definitely look as though they want to make this move count and the keeper able to hold on to it Antonin Barak. Delightful pass. Well, the clearance half-hearted. Really good high press. Can he put them in front? Well, it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. And a harmless effort when all is said and done. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. Oh, managing to beat him. Really good challenge. Griezmann. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Paul Pogba every pass hitting its target and that's the end of that move for now pressing high to win the ball Benzema now Pogba Mbappe it's a perfect challenge Mbappe sustained pressure and they have the ball now Griezmann Benzema an effective challenge Kral and the attacking options appear plentiful and possibilities here Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Teo Hernandez. Mbappe with it. A chance there. The two teams have switched around. And are ready now for the second half. Antonin Barak. Sheik with it. Still passing it around with authority. Kral. 
Antonin Barak. Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? Skipping away. Well, possibilities in the centre. Well, up a cul-de-sac in terms of the attack. Well, probably a fair assessment of his first half's work would be a mixed bag. Well, he didn't contribute enough in that first half. I think he needs to work harder to get on the ball. He was far too static. In my view, he's got to make more runs behind this back line in the second half. A chance now with the corner. Still not clear. Kimpembe. He made it look simple, really. Mbappe. Now Griezmann. And a... To take the lead. Well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. Well, not the best clearance. And I think the threat has been averted. Suchek. It's with Novak. Playing with purpose and control. Opportunity missed. Alert defending. Schick. Outdoing his opponent. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Will he finish? Squanders the chance for 1-0. Well, that's a big miss. They should be leading now. And into the last 20 minutes. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. France with the ball again. Griezmann, effective pressure to regain possession. Antonin Barak. And Patrick Schick now. Must take the lead here. Oh, is he going to be punished here? Really important tackle. Well, advantage with them. Referee says play on. Could be a chance to break here. Pogba Benzema and nothing positive comes of it unfortunately well, being pressed here Philip Novak now Alex Kral and he read it well And a goal at this stage could be decisive. Karim Benzema. Pogba. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Possession one. And that is the whistle for the end of the 90. When you want to get off that darkest ground But gravity pulls you straight down Earth from a bird's eye view Feathers and see this too. When you want to get off the darkest ground, the gravity pulls you straight down.
I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And no question, this ought to be a game that gets pulses racing. It's the Czech Republic, and they take on Spain. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Useful cross towards the near post. Oh, my goodness! He's caught that so well! A goal of the highest class! Fantastic technique! So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0.
making progress. And a decent delivery. That ball was put into the right area, but no one able to capitalise. A foul, but advantage played. Promising looking ball. How to play it goes. He was under a bit of pressure. Well, the referee took note of the earlier infringement, and a booking it is now. Well, nicely cut out. Oh, left his man behind here. And brave goalkeeping to deal with the danger. Well, he had to get that right, didn't he? That's good goalkeeping. Morasa. Koke with it. Marcos Alonso. Now, what can they do from here? Getting in there to intercept. Philip Novak. Kopitz. Options in the middle. It's got to be! What a lovely strike! Lethal piece of finishing. Drilled home with true conviction. Tremendous goal. So back underway following the equaliser. Over the touchline for a throw in. Koke. Not much time to make up his mind. Morata. Difficult to stop him. And back with Busquets. Sarabia. Morata. Sarabia. On to Koke. This looks interesting. A chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. And going short with it. Suchek. Vidra might go ahead and a wonderful diving save to deny the opportunity short corner favoured oh and a perfect ball now how about this well quite simply not precise enough from that position Morasa and a fine tackle They've regained possession. Sergio Busquets. Well, showing excellent judgment to intercept. And Patrick Schick now. Defensive efficiency personified. Now the manager. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Danny Olmo. This might be ideal for the counter. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. And slipped through beautifully. Well, he's lost it. Not giving him a moment's peace. Jan Kopitz. A move of promise on the flank. Patrick Sheen! So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? An 
creative look about this. And he's keen on cutting in. Oh, how on earth has he missed that? What a glorious opportunity. Well, the flag's gone up and he was offside, but he didn't know that when he took his shot. Getting in there to take it away. Retaining possession, proving difficult. Vidra. And that'll be the goalkeeper's ball. Jan Kopitz. It's with Novak. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Oh, breezing past him. And using his body to good effect. Into the final 20 minutes. Koke. Sergio Busquets. A foul, but advantage played. Busquets. On to Koke. And the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty given. And now to level the game. Still a chance. And a time for calm on the ball. Schick. Vidra. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Koke. Now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. He would be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Well, he has the measure of his opponent. And there it is, a penalty given and a chance perhaps for them to finish this off. And this could finish it off. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Sergio Busquets. On to Sergio Roberto. Pablo Sarabia. And forward they go, chasing the game. Morata. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. He thwarted the attack illegally. Now, perhaps a card is forthcoming. And that is the end of the contest and not a happy outcome as far as the...
And so the battle commences. Well, that'll be a free kick. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. And Benzema! And denied by the keeper. Impressive. A possession lost, intercepted. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Good visualisation and execution. Oya Sabal! Thwarting him. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. Alvaro Morata has gone and scored. So France get the ball rolling once more. We're about to find out how they're going to react to the setback. Koke. And showing fine vision. Well, the danger is still there. Cuts it back. Busquets. And a goal! The quick one, too. And they've turned this game on its head. So, 2-0 now. We're getting the ball forward. Morata on to Koke. And winning it back. Well, they're being outplayed here, and the fans are not happy. They need to show more urgency now. Top class defending. Can they exploit the space out wide? Disappointing for France to give it away like that. Sergi Roberto not given much thinking time. Well, there it is, as expected. Spain have controlled most of the ball so far. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. And pull back. Able to get his body in the way. Well, they haven't seen too many chances, but the crowd sensing this could be a turning point. They need a goal here. Koke. It's a weighted pass. Well, visionary passing. Could it be? And he's certainly in the mood for his second. Well, he's certainly looking a threat. He looks so sharp today. Morata, can he put it away? And still danger here. Well, sometimes they come off for you, sometimes they don't, Stuart. Well, he didn't get the technique right there, and as a result, he mistimes the contact on the ball. Sergio Busquets. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Well, half-time coming up, and this is not exactly what the home fans came to see. Stuart, your thoughts on what we've seen? Well, they've been outplayed in this first half, and they need that half-time whistle to come soon so they can regroup, change one or two things tactically, and come out with a better attitude in the second 45. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? Clean challenge. The first half here comes to an end. The two teams have switched around. And are ready now for the second half. Pablo Sarabia. 
And now they have the ball back. Well, the outcome is a free kick here. Benzema. And he read it well defensively. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Teo Hernandez. And teammates to play it to. And behind it's gone for a corner. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Really good challenge. And showing fine vision. And a good take under duress there. Mbappe. Pogba has it. Aurelien Chouameni. Able to skip past his man. So a throw in here. Good visualization and execution. And Bahan foiling them. Couldn't hang on to it. Busquets. Can he convert? Well, what a stop that was. Oh, the keeper needed to do an awful lot better. Well, I still can't believe that didn't go in, Derek. It's a fantastic stop from the keeper, you have to say. He went in so dangerously with that tackle. Now, the referee is the man everyone's looking at. Well, he has been dismissed, and it was going so well. Well, that's going to make it interesting now. He's just put his team under pressure here. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. But I think he knew that was coming. Yellow card it is. Well, that was always going to happen. He needs to... Now, this could really lift spirits. Oh, a tremendous block. Playing it short. Mbappe. Now Pogba. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. This might be ideal for the counter. Danny Olmo. Now Busquets. Excellent challenge. Teo Hernandez. Oh, moving it nicely. Griezmann. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Oya Sabal. Well, the pass not finding its target. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. Could reduce the deficit. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what.
Something I can see is my own silhouette I'm getting stronger Step by step The clock is ticking But there's no time for me I've been flying from town to town And the match is underway. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris is the goalkeeper. Rafael Varane plays alongside Presnel Kimpembe at the back. And the strike pair, Karim Benzema, plays together with Kylian Mbappe. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, the best players can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas, in and around the box. His creativity is excellent. Playing little one-twos, balls round the corner, linking up with other teammates, just to have that little bit of penetration. He's going to be key to breaking down this defence. And in the perfect position to read it. And Patrick Schick now. No way through. It's a short one. Kral. Well, he has players waiting at the back post. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. Fine cross into the middle. Still not clear. Pavard and a struggle for France to keep the ball and Patrick Schick now must take the lead here and they have you've got to say it has been coming so 
Well, the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Adam Hlozek. And Patrick Schick now. Can he finish this? Oh, could be. And missing the chance to give them a bit of breathing space. Well, that should have made it more comfortable, shouldn't it? But it's a wasted opportunity. Teo Hernandez. Now with Benzema. And dispossessed. Schick. Oh, lovely ball. And that'll be the goalkeeper's ball. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. This looks more than decent. Well, not the greatest pass. Easily intercepted. Straightforward piece of goalkeeping. Can he finish? Oh, a goal! And a moment the goalkeeper would like to forget all about. Well, a second goal for them here. He's beaten his man. Benzema. A goal! That's exactly what they needed. That should get them believing again. So there we have it. 2-1. Kral. A fine use of the ball. Well, the attack peters out, and that means it's goalkeeper's ball. Is it going to be? In the opinion of the referee, that is a penalty. A chance to extend the lead. A chance, and this situation could be dangerous. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending, no problems grabbing hold of that one. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. A chance then for the rest. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Paul Pogba Aurelien Chouameni Well they want that equaliser but the passing remains smooth well, Trying to take their time but not enough care on the ball This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity All hands on deck well, they've won themselves a corner and a chance perhaps to add an additional goal for security. Oh, great vision. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. A big moment here, Derek. And a goal! Cause for celebrations again. Two in front. Well, the hosts, as you can see, have enjoyed so much possession and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football and they look like scoring more. Well, the only way to say it is he got it all horribly wrong, Stuart. Well, he has to make the keeper work harder than that. That's a tame finish. And Patrick Schick now. A glorious chance. him apparently goals in plentiful supply 4-1 currently and Patrick Schick now and the keeper flings himself at the ball they favoured a short one here well the clearance half-hearted 
danger averted for now. Benzema. Benzema. And Pavard on the ball. He takes aim. Well, not quite the result he was hoping for with that shot. Close, though. Adam Hlozek. Excellent challenge. Benzema. Just couldn't capitalise there. Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. A very effective challenge put in. Mbappe just can't get it past him. Who can they pick out? And he's dispatched the header. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Mbappe could pull one back here. Oh, we have just witnessed a special moment. Pure quality. Well, how about this? 4-3. Well, it's almost over, but not quite. The fans still with a bit of nail-biting to do, Stuart. Well, what a game this has been. Some of their attacking play has been absolutely brilliant. They were playing fluent football, but then the foul, and now you would anticipate a yellow card. Into the box it goes. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. He continues his run. Oh, a vital interception. The fans keen on a shot here. This could be it. And it is. He's done it. Surely a case of game over. And that will be all for this game. Defeat for the visitors. That's the big story. Well, Derek, they weren't at their best today.
Jack it up. As always, Derek, we've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully, we're not disappointed. Here's the lineup for Spain David De Gea stands between the posts, Emeric Laporte plays with Sergio Ramos at the back. Sergio Busquets plays alongside Koke in central midfield and the main striker today is Morata. Marcos Alonso. Koke with it. Marcos Alonso. It's opening up for them. Alonso, excellent block. This looks interesting. Has a go. Oh, magnificent from the keeper. Fantastic stop. Corner kick from Koke. On the corner, too close to the goalkeeper that time. Jan Kopitz and very deftly cut out must take the lead here and the cross not quite imaginative enough the attack continues they're making considerable progress but nothing comes of it Alonso. He's given us away. Suchek. And Kopitz with it. And he read it superbly. Vladimir Kuval. Klozek. Going well, but nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Oh, he's given the ball away. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Danny Olmo and on the ball Sarabia Sergio Busquets Koke with it and it's at the moment for Morata that's a great stop well his reflexes are so good there that's a fantastic stop it has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in getting in there to intercept Losing possession a bit easily. Now well, they get the ball once more. Morata. But well, he's got past his man. Well, danger averted thanks to his teammate. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. Okay. It's with Oyar Sabal. Busquets. And he's through here. That is that.
The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. And they need to get tighter. Kral. Top class defending. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Can they keep it going? Well, that was easy on the eye, and he didn't miss by much. Well, that's how to counter-attack. They did it with such pace, just couldn't finish it off. Kral. Schick. And Patrick Schick now. But they dealt with the threat posed. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Well, as you can see from the possession, there's been little between these two teams. It's been a really tight and cagey affair. You just hope it opens up a little and that one of these teams is willing to take a few risks. Can he put them in front? Well, it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have... Oh, surely. Watered by the post. And a throw-in it's going to be. Well, you sense the goal's coming. They're getting so close now, they just need to take one of these chances. Ramos and on the ball Sarabia and threading it forward and read the danger magnificently well if he gets this wrong a penalty and a sending off but he was spot on with his challenge well it could be on for him here terrific save well that's a top class save he read it so well well, they've been frustrated for quite a while now, but these fans have suddenly come to life. Well, the clearance, half-hearted. And the counter looks on here, options available. Well shown inside. Koke. Spot on with that tackle. Couldn't hang on to the ball. Sergio Busquets. Danny Olmo with it. And Morata's in the vicinity. And no nonsense defensive clearance. An opportunity to forge ahead from this corner situation. Counter attacking, very much an option. The referee correctly decided to play advantage on the attack as a chopping challenge and the referee has got to have a big think about it. And Patrick Schick now just can't get it past the wall. Oyar Sabal. Sergio Busquets and scope for them to produce something exciting Sarabia so after that a goal kick it'll be Vladimir Kuval here's Patrick Sheik well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. Working really well as a team to regain possession. Still pushing for what could be a winner. Can he put it away?
And the contest begins. Sergio Busquets. Morata. But quick thinking defensively. Paul Pogba and he might be through here great reflex action well that should have been a goal mind you it's a brilliant save so the corner played into the box and well, they've won possession back what can they do from here and a strong tackle Aurelien Chouameni. Benzema. Very quick thinking there. Oh, he's really opened them up here. Can he do it? And he gobbles up the second chance. Disappointment for the keeper. No wonder he's asking questions of his defence. So back underway. Will there be a response from France here? And the referee felt he had to blow the whistle. Benzema. Possession lost by France. Danny Olmo. Oh, lovely incisive pass. And a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. Applying vigorous pressure. Must score! Oh, a tremendous block. Corner kick awarded. And let's see if this will help them add to the lead. Not the best clearance. Busquets. Sarabia. And it crossed the byline. A goal kick as a result. And very deftly cut out. Mbappe. Mbappe. This could square the game. And that's exactly what has transpired. Now, that could be a massive turning point. And momentum is with them. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. And he stopped them just when they looked menacing. Ball's gone. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Sergio Busquets. Pogba has it. And slipped through by Karim Benzema. Griezmann's in behind. And a goal to delight the fans. Just what they were hoping for. So back underway. Intriguing contest this, given the 2-1 scoreline. Morata. 
Well, it's one pass after another. Okay. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. A chance then for the respective manager. And the ball is moving again, with France looking to build on a largely positive first-half performance here. Sergio Roberto. Pablo Sarabia. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. Pogba, the delighted scorer. No shortage of goals on this match. 3-1. And breaking at pace with Menace. Good visualisation and execution. Oyar Sabal. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Spot on with that tackle. Mbappe and couldn't keep himself onside pressing high and they have the ball again Mbappe and possession given away they might be able to get in now defensive Brazilians to shut them down and Koke in the vicinity Oh, he's given it. The referee says penalty and an opportunity for them to pull one back here. Well, no card handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty... And he puts it away confidently. Well, the action underway once more. And no shortage of entertainment. 3-2. Rafael Varane. Well, that's the kind of player you want from your defender. Teo Hernandez. And France pushing forward with options available. Mbappe. Possession lost by France. Morata. And it's a quality pass. But the keeper takes command. In search of the equaliser. They take it short. Oh, great defending. Danger averted for now, but it'll be another corner. Playing it short. Well, time just challenged magnificently. Over the byline, hence a goal kick. Teo Hernandez. Chouameni. Pogba has it. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. Benzema. And a goal! So the current score line 4 2. And the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. Aurelien Chouameni. Oh, a nice looking pass. And a good save. Well, it is a good save. The idea was good, the execution wasn't. And play halted, free kick given. Well, he knows he's on his last warning after that one. Well, I don't think it warranted a yellow card. He made a genuine attempt to play the ball there.
And the timing was perfect. Ball one. Breaking at pace. Sarabia. Koke. And here's Sarabia. Morata's pass, but given away. And we will have a couple chances on. Well, the keeper had a lot to do. Well, it's a great piece of goalkeeping. So quick off his line. And that will be all for this game. Defeat for the visitors.
Warm welcome. Our footballing travels have taken us today to the Midlands. We're here at the King Power Stadium. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Leicester City taking on Chelsea. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Firing is in. And a goal! Not wasting much time today. They strike first. It'll be interesting to see whether or not Chelsea can articulate an appropriate reply. Mateo Kovacic lost possession well read to put an end to that attack well it's a really poor challenge now what's the referee going to do about it so we have an early booking here to report, Stuart. Yeah, and I think the referee's absolutely right. He's just making it clear to all the players out there he's not going to take any messing about here. Well, that's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. And providing width. Now he must favour the cross. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Iheanacho. Will he find the net? It's gone in! Will the... defensively a real opening now and the keeper nowhere to be found not that he's complaining three goals without reply the referee correctly decided to play advantage well the advantage didn't really accrue to them and so it's going to be a free kick well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. Oh, a lovely incisive pass. A matter of keeping his composure. And it's a goal from the bright young American, Christian Pulisic. So there it is. 3-1 the current scoreline here. What can Chelsea do from this position? And back with Havertz. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Ian 
Iannaccio. Read it superbly to take back possession. Jorginho. It is now with Jorginho. The high press was on, and that, my goodness, that save, fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. And well, they're going for the short one. It's wholehearted defending, and the concession of a corner here. But he's gone short with it. Kovacic. And now with Havertz, putting his body on the line. This might have potential. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. Well, possibilities in the centre. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. Werner couldn't grab hold of it oh is he going to be punished here a chance then for the so underway again and Leicester City very much bossing the game up to now will there be a response in the second 45 And Chelsea looking dangerous. Defensive resilience to shut them down. Ricardo Pereira. Bad pass. Wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up. Werner well read to put an end to that attack not problematic for the keeper electing to cross into the centre oh a moment of pure class had to catch it perfectly and didn't he just so they restart the game and only one team in it Pulls it back, and still a chance. Good bit of pressing. Now we're into the final half hour. Well, what a brilliant save that was. I can't... The defender put in the challenge, and it might be a red card. And in the refereeing trade, they call it Dogzo. Denial of a goal-scoring opportunity. Well, the referee's got that right. He saved a possible goal there, but at a cost. And a goal! Almost bewitching in its beauty. Excellent technique. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Substitution for Leicester City. Kai Havertz. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. Just now with Jorginho. It opens up for Havertz. Well denied by the keeper, but really he only has himself to blame. Kai Havertz. Moving forward effectively, but quick thinking defensively. Iannaccio. What a block! Ricardo Pereira. 
Jamie Vardy now. And breaking at pace with Menis. A glorious chance. And danger still. Well, it could have been, but for the offside flag. Well, not long to go now. And a good day at the office for Leicester City, Stuart. Well, they've controlled most of the game, haven't they? Their one and two touch passing has been sharp. The movement's been bright. And now, hold on, Stuart. They're in here. Couldn't grab hold of it. Ten minutes left for play. Jorginho, Kai Havertz, could be! Well, the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. In it goes! It looked as though they were down and out. Not a bit of it. What will happen next? Well, how about this? 4-3. And back with Thomas. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Could be a chance to break here. Ziesch. Werner. And attempting the through ball. What a vital intervention. So the final whistle, and that's not how Chelsea.
Hello, our action comes to you from the English Midlands, from the King Power Stadium. My name is Derek Ray, excited to be bringing you match commentary. And alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Leicester City facing Manchester City. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Well, here's how Leicester City will line up. Kasper Schmeichel stands between the posts. Chalar Seyunchu plays alongside Johnny Evans in central defence. Yuri Tiedemans plays alongside Wilfred Ndidi in the engine room. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Introducing the starting players for Manchester City. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Joao Cancelo starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield. And they line up with... Oh, can he finish it, Derek? A truly magnificent start. An early goal in the game. Just what they were hoping to produce. And Leicester get the ball rolling once more. We're about to find out how they're going to react to the setback. Promising looking ball. Gabriel Jesus. De Bruyne. Foden. Will it be? And he's kept it out. Fully stretched. Somehow reaching it. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Walker. A very good tackle. They've given him too much space. But after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Iannaccio. Really good challenge. Walker. And intercepts again. Tielemans this is Amate and he's beaten his man comprehensively cuts it back and it's in all square again what a match this is turning out to be so underway again here on the back of that leveller Walker Rodri and Manchester City moving the ball with purpose a really top-notch piece of defending the pressure was high and they could be in here and a goal just like that they're back in front so underway once more Manchester City with the advantage Foden Ronaldo Silva top class defending Tielemans how about the cross Evans Madison but quick thinking defensively De Bruyne Gabriel Jesus and he stopped them just when they looked menacing and so it is so the second half underway with Leicester behind can they turn this game around that's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack Rodri, Phil Foden now, Silva, oh a lovely ball, not going to get away with that, 
because it's offside here. And he shouldn't be offside there. He's gone too early, and that's a waste of a great opportunity. Into the advanced position. But nothing comes of it. Well, as complete a midfield player as you're likely to see, Kevin De Bruyne. Stuart, your assessment of his performance? Well, I thought he had a very good first half, and key to that was his movement. Time and time again, he got in behind the opposition, and he was a real threat throughout the game. And I'm sure we're going to see more of him in the second half. Can he put it away? Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Rodri! And a goal it is for Manchester City. They are the team on course for victory. Now the action continues, and no shortage of goals. 3-1 as things stand. Iheanacho. Here's Tielemans. Ran it superbly to take back possession. It is advantage Manchester City here. And he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. James Madison. Jamie Vardy now. Tielemans. Now they are to intercept. And that pass could be troublesome. Bernardo Silva. Tremendous block. And they could face difficulties here. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Bernardo Silva, he's in behind. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. So the action continues and City really cantering to victory here. Kevin De Bruyne and it's Gabriel Jesus not to be advised giving the ball away in that position he made it look simple really City have the ball again 10 minutes to go De Bruyne, determined defending. Gabriel Jesus, and return to Gabriel Jesus. Opportunity, real defensive resilience. And Bernardo Silva has it, couldn't hang on to it. And he might be through here. It's got to be. Can they put it away? Finally gathered by the keeper. Well, that's a really good recovery. He had to be smart there. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. So the final whistle and frustration for...
here's the lineup for Chelsea. Edouard Mendy starts in goal. Antonio Rudiger plays with Andreas Christensen in central defence. Jorginho plays alongside Mateo Kovacic in central midfield. And handed the task of playing up front today, Romelu Lukaku. Excellent challenge. Bernardo Silva. De Bruyne now. Bit wasteful from City. Kai Havertz. Kovacic. An utterly disappointing cross. Goal kick. to hit the target with his pass and it'll be a throw in and intercepted it really good challenge He's given the ball away unnecessarily. Oh, splendid skill. De Bruyne. Is it going to be? Well, last gasp defending, but brilliant defending. Mateo Kovacic. And Christensen. Rhys James. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Kai Havertz. Kovacic! Emerson in goal made it look easy. Sloppy there, Bernardo Silva. Christensen. Jorginho. James. It's with Hakim Ziyech. Rhys James. And now they have the ball back. Given away by Manchester City once more. Ziyech. Attacking possibilities for Chelsea. Havertz. In the right place to cut out the pass. Gabriel Jesus. Foden. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Christensen. Thiago Silva. Chilwell. He's given it straight to the opposition. Can he play it in? Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Rodri. Good visualisation and execution. A really top-notch piece of defending. Wonderful challenge, and a throw-in coming up. Pulisic. Kai Havertz. Well, no stopping him. That's a useful cross. Smuggled away. And so the first time... And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. De Bruyne. Now with Jesus.
And teammates to play it to. Sends it back. That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. He's driven in the corner. In the corner, too close to the goalkeeper that time. Free kick to Chelsea. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. And the keeper has possession of it. Rodri. Now can they counter clinically? The cross is on. And a tidy tackle. James. Here's Christensen. Mateo Kovacic. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Gabriel Jesus. Far from a good pass. And now passing it through. Well, he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. De Bruyne. Phil Foden now. Well, as the stats show us, this has been a really even game so far. There just hasn't been enough guile or invention in the top third of the field from either team, which needs to change at some point. And Pulisic has it. It is now with Jorginho. And here's Ziyech. Brilliantly blocked. Chelsea's corner as they try to take the lead here. Elects to go short. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. Well, the counter chance looks very real. De Bruyne. Foden. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Can he put them in front? Well, it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. 15 minutes left for play. Chilwell. Werner. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Jack Grealish. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And that's great work to make sure it didn't go over the line. How can they nudge in front late on here? And let's give credit to the defending. Well, the fans are making so much noise here. They believe the winner's coming, but it needs a moment of inspiration for one of those players out on the pitch. What a finale we've got. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. They're following the deflection, a corner kick coming up here. And deciding to go short with this one. Corner again. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Making sure nothing came of it. Well read to put an end to that attack. Jack Grealish. And showing fine vision. But they're not being allowed to continue. It's offside. Well, he had the vision to pick out the pass, but he couldn't play it quite quickly enough. So two minutes of stoppage time here. Progress made by Chelsea, and at this late stage, a goal could be decisive. And so the referee brings the 90 minutes.
jack it up. So Leicester City will line up. Kasper Schmeichel begins in goal. Johnny Evans plays with Chalar Soyuncu in central defence. Wilfred Ndidi starts with Yuri Tielemans in the centre of midfield. And it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal-scoring threat. Attacking possibilities for Chelsea. Played into the box. There it is! The opening goal of this match. And what a start they've made. And Leicester get the ball rolling once more. We're about to find out how they're going to react to the setback. Oh, good vision. And possession given away. Pulisic. On to Werner. Kai Havertz. Ziyech. It's neat passing. Confidence on the ball. Kovacic. Now with Jorginho. Can he make it count? No real threat, you've got to say. Eccentric goalkeeping. Werner. Jorginho. Can they keep it out? And in the end, no damage done. Well, that save just about keeps them in this. But they have to pose more of a threat at the other end. And now they have the ball back. Chilwell. Thiago Silva. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Kovacic using all his defensive acumen to cut it out
Iannaccio. Ricardo Pereira. He's got to score! Oh, magnificent reaction. Holding the ball up here, waiting for others to arrive. Werner. Timo Werner. And a goal! They're going to take some stopping now. Two in front here. Well, a second goal for them here. Well, that's a well-timed pass. And the alarm bells are ringing. And a goal! A running riot here. Almost out of sight. Well, the ball is moving again. And there's no getting away from it. Chelsea are really in the mood here. Very comfortable when in possession. Chance to finish. Can he finish? And a goal. Well, it looks easy when you can put them away like that. Blistering first half display. And just look at that score. Went in strongly, decisively. Kai Havertz. Can they convert? Just can't get it past him. And fine work from Chelsea to win the ball back. Well, there you have it. Your way team has so much of the possession, and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. A chance then for the respective manager. So back in business, the second half is underway. Leicester's difficulties there for all to see in the first 45. How do they respond now? And the referee has awarded the free kick. He tried to play advantage, but it wasn't forthcoming. Kovacic, and it might be, oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals, no let up here. Oh, my goodness, it's so one-sided, 5-0 in this match. And play halted, free kick given. Madison, and they stopped them just when they looked menacing. Very deftly cut out. Oh, lovely bit of skill. He made it look simple, really. Well, the attack showed promise, but easy work for the keeper in the end. And the right place to cut out the pass. Havertz, Kovacic, Werner, oh big opportunity, keeper did his job to begin with, Tielemans, now Ricardo Pereira has it, could play it in, Referee points to the spot, penalty. Well, no card handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty... In it goes! A well-taken penalty! A glut of goals, 5-1 it is. Made it a bit too easy for his opponent. Well, then there to tidy up. Indeedy. Jamie Vardy now. And Iannaccio has it. Thiago Silva wins it. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. A really top-notch piece of defending. James Madison. Well, the counter chance looks very real. 
but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Almost weighing up the opposition with a string of neat passes. And a throw in forthcoming. Well, that is annoying for any manager to see your own player giving the ball away from a throw in. Pulisic. Now with Havertz. And Pulisic has it. And now with Kovacic. Ten minutes to go then. Vardy. Madison with it. Chance for Vardy! Interception to snuff out the danger. Tielemans. Well, the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. Werner. The Chelsea move still flowing. Advantage to them. Delivered into the area here. Well, not the best clearance. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Iheanacho. The pressure was on the keeper following the threaded pass. And that is that. The referee brings this match to an end and Chelsea get the three points.
to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. Well, here's how Leicester City will line up. Kasper Schmeichel stands between the posts. Chalar Seyunchu plays alongside Johnny Evans in central defence. Yuri Tiedemans plays alongside Wilfred Ndidi in the engine room. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. Given away by City. Good use of advantage by the referee. Shot attempted. Terrific block. And Ian Acho has it. Well, options at the back post here. Absolutely nothing wrong with the idea, but no end product. Not troubling the keeper. Walker. And it's Ruben Dias. Take it away. Oh, he's really opened them up here. Can they forge ahead? They do. And you've got to say they're good value for the lead. On they go again. A wake-up call for the City players, maybe. Can they find a response now? Excellent challenge. That's an exquisite pass from Gabriel Jesus. Gabriel Jesus! And that's what they needed, Manchester City. A goal to level matters here. So the ball is rolling again at one all. Tielemans read it superbly to take back possession Torres was spot on with that challenge well brilliant work to keep that one in play Leicester now in a potentially dangerous position well, it looks so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. De Bruyne. Now with Jesus. Sterling. Foden. De Bruyne. He must finish! Oh yes! A goal! Exactly what they were looking for, and he's come up with it! Well, 2-1 it is here. So almost at half-time, and not quite going to plan for Leicester in terms of the scoreline. Stuart, how would you assess what you've seen from them in this half? Well, it's been a good game, but they've been second best in a couple of key areas. That needs to change in the second half, otherwise it's going to be a disappointing result for them. And so it is. And back underway, Leicester looking to find a route back into this one. Iheanacho. Sloppy in possession from Leicester. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here.
But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Well, he didn't let his team down in the first half, did he? I'm talking about Phil Foden. Stewart interested to get your take. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. And it's a quality pass. Not to be this time. A really intense pressure applied. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Over the touchline for a throw-in. And a poor ball. 30 minutes to go then. It's Sterling cutting in. Well, he didn't catch it badly, but certainly questions to be asked about the lack of accuracy there. Vardy. Iheanacho. Given away by Leicester. Oh, that's a fine pass. Sterling. Space and time for the cross. Sterling. It's there for him. Oh, my goodness! He's caught that so well. A goal of the highest class. Fantastic technique. Well, the action continues, and no shortage of goals. 3-1 as things stand. Iheanacho. Madison with it. And the emphasis is on creativity. Ndidi. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. Sterling Foden and here's Cancelo must be well negligent in front of goal no two ways about that Foden opportunity here well he had a lot of ground to cover splendid save and played short De Bruyne and looking towards the back post not all that convincing defensively. But it looked so threatening, but the danger averted. Committed challenge. Beautifully weighted ball. The end product just wasn't there. And not far away from full time, it hasn't been Leicester's day, Stuart. Well, there's been a real lack of energy right from the start of the game. Certainly when they haven't... Oh, wait, the... Stuart, they might score! Oh, there it is! A lifeline in this game! And what a finale we could be in for here! Well, the game has been restarted. 3-2 here. And smart defending. Well, there goes the final whistle, and really...
ready with his tactics board to provide all the analysis is Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It is Chelsea facing Manchester City. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? A City free kick forthcoming. City know that wide area is really opening up. And Sterling has it. Is it going to be Raheem Sterling? And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. They take it short. De Bruyne. And crossed in there. And the danger is still there. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Can they hit on the break? Real chance. And the flag has been raised here. Well, there can't have been a lot in that. Foden. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Pulisic and Pulisic has it now showing excellent judgment to intercept Gabriel Jesus and Chelsea did well to regain control of it Ziyech. Well, they keep passing away. Well, it didn't go as a plan in the end. Well, he likes to run at them. Mares. Well, offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. scent of something positive defensive Brazilians to shut them down over the top towards Raheem Sterling applying vigorous pressure Gabriel Jesus and the assistant referee with the flag raised well you just question if he could have let that run he must have known he was offside well as those stats show us Chelsea haven't controlled the possession of the game but their counter-attacking has been really good particularly in the wide areas it's been an excellent performance from them so far chance to attack using width and the snuffing out of the cross there and under pressure that was a fine claim Gabriel Jesus went in strongly decisively Defensive efficiency personified. And Chelsea get the decision from the referee. It is now with Jorginho. Just cutting off the supply. Riyad Mahrez. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Mares. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. Oh, what an exquisite goal! Absolute perfection! So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 here. And if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. And he could really get at the opposition, but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. 
De Bruyne. Can they forge ahead? Well, what a stop that was. And the first 45 minutes have... So the beginning of the second half here in West London. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Foden. Joao Cancelo. Phil Foden now. Lost possession. And it's Gabriel Jesus. He's blocked it! But I think it's fair to say Riyad Mahrez acquitted himself well in the first half. Stuart, what did you make of him? Well, Derek, he plugged away in that first half, making run after run without too much success. But eventually he got his reward, and what an important goal it was. And with that, the attack fizzles out. De Bruyne with a chance. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Chilwell. Delightful pass. And Pulisic has it. He's got it for the net. Brilliant piece of finishing. Magnificent goal. On they go again. A wake-up call for the City players, maybe. Can they find a response now? I think the referee was spot on there. A free kick in the end after he had attempted to play advantage. Mateo Kovacic. Pulisic now. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. Well, as the stats confirm, City have controlled the ball, but it means nothing unless they start to be more creative, particularly in the wide areas. Up to this point, they've been too easy to defend against. He's managed to lose his marker. Sterling. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Werner. Breaking at pace. It looks promising. And let's give credit to the defending. Jesus. Sterling has it. Foden. Through ball from De Bruyne. And the goalkeeper expertly anticipated that through ball. Pulisic. Beautifully weighted ball. overcome all the difficulties and in the end no damage done intelligent threaded pass here it could be for Raheem Sterling well not the greatest pass easily intercepted Rodri this could square the game and it has such late excitement, and no wonder they're jumping for joy as we speak. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. And Chelsea still knocking on the door in the closing minutes. Can they find a winner? And the ball played over from the flank, but meet and grip to the foot. And a chance it is for Chelsea, but the keeper takes command of the situation. And he failed to get it away properly. Danger averted for now. And Chelsea have given us away. It's a promising City move. Must take the lead here. Dear, oh dear, he squandered it. Well, that should have been the winner with so little time left. He can't believe he didn't score there. Timo Werner. And there's the final whistle, the big headline.
to its billing. It's Slavia Prague, and they face Sparta Prague. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Delivered into the area here. Well, it all counts for naught. And it wasn't a great pass, was it? Possession lost. Well, play stopped. It is a free kick. Pressing high to win the ball. Takes aim! Well, he couldn't quite keep it on target. Just wide. How well, far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. Not that they look as though they want to make this move count. It's wholehearted defending and the concession of a corner here. Not the best clearance. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. Klojek. This might be ideal for the counter. A chance to whip it in. Well, not to be in terms of the counter attack. Loves to attack from the wide areas. A tremendous block. So the corner played into the box. And it still could be dangerous. Really good challenge. David Hansko. Klojek. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. And giving the ball away. And attempting the through ball. And the cross not quite imaginative enough. Cleared away comprehensively. An opportunity to forge ahead from this corner situation. And the counter attack is on. Options available. And a throw in it's going to be. They've won back possession. A really intense pressure applied. In possession to give them the lead, maybe. Excellent block. Making progress. Play towards the back post. Oh, a goal! They strike first, and what a way to silence the crowd. So, underway again here. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? Adam Hlozek. Hansko. Well, lovely work to get past his man. Will it happen for them? It's there for him. Reading it well. An effective challenge. And with that, the first half draws. The 
The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Dutch Cal. Well, there to intercept. Petrushevchik. Good work to regain possession. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, he certainly had an impact on that first half, scoring that late goal, but I thought his overall contribution was really good, and he got better as the half wore on. And dispossessed. Now, oh, doesn't get away with it. Free kick given. The referee might well have been tempted to book him for that. Resisted the temptation. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. Well, no damage done. Take it away. Superb block. Must be! Well, just fractionally wide. Good strike. And into the last 30 minutes now. Good looking sequence. And the referee says corner kick. And now the delivery. Struggling to get it away. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Breaking at pace. All in all, a broken counter-attack. On and on he goes. Well, still an issue here. And I think the threat has been averted. Oscar Dorley. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. And that puts them in position. Oh, a save right out of the top drawer. Superstop. Now, will the keeper have to pay the price for that mistake? He's blocked it. I must say, this looks promising. Takes the shot. Well, fantastic reflex action. Error from the keeper. Will they seize on it? Chance to finish. Marvellous anticipation. Well, the fans are driving their team on here, but can they respond with a goal? Time is running out. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Well, time tackle. How can they find a late leveller? away again here on the back of that leveller Dutch Cal and still on the lookout for the goal that could be so important at this juncture and space to exploit maybe well just one minute of time added on for stoppages here well, this corner could be pivotal. It might represent the last chance to get in front in the dying moments. Clean challenge. Well, the referee blows the whistle. Nothing.